Hey guys, this is TJ with View Rail, and today I'm here to help you get some exact measurements for your glass railing. You received a glass railing measuring kit and a post layout drawing. What you'll want to do is grab that drawing, identify run one, and once you've identified run one, go to that area on your deck and uh, we'll proceed to the next step. All right, so you've received your template kit um, and inside that kit, you're gonna, uh, you're gonna have your acrylic templates. Um, this is gonna represent the foot of the ascend talon and the termination of the glass itself. So we're gonna take two of these and we're gonna start on a corner condition. Set our templates in, ensuring that the foot is going directly into the, into the mounting material. Um, and not over uh, and directly through your overhang. So take into account that overhang. Um, on this deck here, we're going to measure it. We've got a one inch overhang. So we need to move this template back from the leading edge of this deck one inch to ensure that these mounting screws are gonna go directly into the backing um, underneath, the, uh, underneath your, your finished deck boards. So one inch. Going to measure the the second overhang over on this side of the corner. We've got one inch on this side as well. So pulling back one inch, lining up our template. The next thing we want to do is go ahead and fasten those templates down with the provided screws. So now that we've got that corner set on the opposite end, we're going to take another, uh, another acrylic template and come to the opposite end. Uh, I've got a staircase that's gonna be descending behind me here. Um, and so this is where the, uh, the run is going to terminate. Again, um, when setting this template, you wanna uh, take into account the, the overhang. Um, so measuring this overhang, I've got exactly a one inch overhang, just like what I had on the corner there. So when I pull this template uh, or place this template, I wanna ensure that my, uh, my template's gonna be going in the exact location as this post. So we need to ensure that these mounting screws are going in the solid material. So with a one inch overhang, I know I've got my mounting material directly underneath that. I'm pulling that from the leading edge back one inch, ensuring that I'm in line with my, uh, with my set corner on that opposite end. Now that those two things are done, go ahead and mount this template in place. All right, guys, now that we've got both uh, templates installed here, what we're gonna be able to do is pull the necessary measurements. So what we wanna be able to do here is pull from the outside of the foot to the outside of the opposite foot, not the end of the glass. What we wanna do is we wanna, we wanna hook our tape, tape measure on the, on the foot itself. Just measuring this run. Again, guys, from one out, uh, from the outside of the first foot to the outside of the of the second foot here, and on this measurement, I've got 143 and a quarter. Now that we've got that measurement of 143 and a quarter, we're going to record it on the back side of this template guide. So, on the back side here, we've got a run type. Uh, we went from an outside corner to a straight, so we'll record that um, in the length of 143 and a quarter. Uh, really, all you have to do is repeat that same process throughout the, um, the rest of your runs on your project, your level runs, and once completed, submit to us and we'll get started on your glass engineered drawings and providing you your railing. <laughs>